I'm Michael Canellis again from Pi World Barcelona. Day three, we're in the Partner Pavilion where it's digital transformation madness. And I'm speaking to Mikhail Koloskov from IPCOS. Tell us about IPCOS, what does it do? Right, IPCAS is a system integrator and we are providing digital oil field services for oil and gas upstream and just across the whole globe, right? And now we're exploring the IoT space because many customers are asking for that. Now, IoT a few years ago, was, there was not a lot of interest in the oil industry. Has it has been picking up? Right, absolutely. We, we see that the many companies are looking to embrace this new technology, especially in the area of uh, automation of the brownfields. And uh, we see more and more requests coming and we've uh, did a pilot, uh, POC pilot, uh, two years ago in Austria on that one. And we see more customers are interested in that. Are they doing two things? So instead of upgrading SCADA, they're using IoT sensors and things like that. Is that what they're mostly doing or is it yeah, just... Well, that... I think that, that a lot of operators are struggling to automate their fields and then they want to have a cheaper commodity solution to get the data, to, to get the data from the field, to collect the data from the field. So that's why they're looking how the IoT might uh, bring this potential, how unlock this automation case. So, uh, Mikhail, tell us what's going on on the screen here. Right, so here we see the Pi Vision screen and we can, we've got the data coming from the H device. So, and of course we could not bring the real field here, so the data coming from the H device is a simulated data, but here we brought the temperature sensor and we connected to the uh, to the age uh, data store and then the age data store uh, aggressed that to the cloud so and we could see here in the pine vision screen which is hosted in the azure cloud that uh, we got the temperature from the booth here and then if we touch the sensor it will warm up and we'll see the emitted direction in real time so that's essentially the uh, the pine vision screen here excellent great well thank you very much